finish it quick then. I'd do the same for you. There you are. What's wrong? Don't you recognize your own sister? Her past once again before her, Teresa's memories returned in a blaze of fire. Oakvale was burning. She watched in silence as the bandits tortured her mother, then turned to her with questions of the missing boy. She answered them only with a stare, and so their leader sliced out her eyes. The raiders took the boy's mother and left Teresa alone in the forest. There she crawled for three days, blind and desolate, until she was found by bandits, Twinblade and his men. She began a new life of servitude among their clan. But the bandit king sensed her exceptional strength and power of will and listened as she whispered dark prophetic truths in her sleep. Those who could never accept this small blind girl standing by their master's side did not last long. When they attacked, she killed them without mercy and without emotion. For this was her place in the world now. I've seen so many things. So much killing. So much dying. I've seen you, little brother, in a ring of sand and blood, an arena full of secrets. And I've seen the choice you'll have to make one day, between the darkness and the light. Teresa! I'm sorry, Twinblade. Your path is alone now. All our paths are. But before I leave, brother, I have a present for you. For all the birthdays I've missed, a power that runs in our family. He finds you when you're sleeping, and when the daylight fades. What are you waiting for? Finish it, or leave me alone. I'm dead anyway. I'm no one's king anymore. Okay, now you're given the option to either leave him alone or kill him. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and kill him, because you get more evil points for that. But if you're going to kill him, you really should kill all the bandits first. Uh, because if you attack him before the, aban the uh, bandits are dead, uh, all of them will jump in all at once. Whereas if you attack the bandits going around kind of in a circle like this, uh, you can fight three or four of them at once uh, and not have everybody attacking you all at the same time. Uh, so I'm going to do that real quick. Okay, now you can take him on. Will never follow me now. Isn't that fine? If that's the way it has to be. Now basically, oops. <laughs> basically you just fight him uh, the same way you normally did last time. I was trying to see if magic did anything to him, but it just has no effect whatsoever. Yay, more tedious rolling. Man, come on and just... 
There you go. Shoot. That's the only downside about this part, is it's just... The fight versus Twin Blade just takes way too long. At least in my opinion. Oh man, you've got to be kidding me. Roll, roll, roll in the hay. Oh, finally. Okay, and if I remember correctly, there is a gem of some kind in here. Steal that real quick. Ooh, a diamond. No idea how much that sells for, but I know it sells for a lot. And then there's supposed to be stuff over here, too. Oh. Gold. All this gold's gonna come really in handy later because uh, not too long from now I'm gonna get to an area where I can start really upgrading my armor and my weapons a lot. So I can use all the money I can get. Alright, now all we have to do is trek all the way back through. Now, rather than just teleport out of here, you really need to zone out to this area, because uh, this is where it actually completes the quest for you. There you go. If you teleport out, it won't complete the quest quite correctly, so it's always better just to do this. And then I usually prefer just to run out, just for fun. You could always teleport out of here, but like I said, I've... I don't know why, I just really like running the whole distance for some reason. I guess it gives me an excuse to try to find and see if I've missed something along the way. Alright. Yeah, I think I'll go ahead and stop for today. Okay. So, now that we're done with that, let's go see what I can get with some experience. I'm sure I can upgrade a lot now. Oh, wow. Take up some physique. Mm. I'll just leave this all here for now. And get some spells. Uh... I don't really like any of those. I can get Drain Life. Drain Life's good because it's kind of the opposite of Heal. Uh, heal gives you good points and Drain Life gives you evil points, so it's always great to use it. You hurt your enemies, heal yourself, and make yourself more evil along the way, so... Win-win, you know? Accuracy allows you to cause more damage in ranged combat and make your shots more precise. I don't really need accuracy, but it'll help in the long run a little bit with uh, making my aiming more steady. You should speak to Maze. He's waiting for you in his quarters, located in the big tower at the back of the guild. Let's see if there's any quests first. Uh, Hob Cave, Traitor Massacre. That always sounds great. Uh, I don't want to rescue anybody. Because her grandson is missing. Alright, let's go find Maze real quick, see what he wants. Yay for lag! So... You really found your sister? <laughs> I'd never have imagined her living among bandits. 
You've really come a long way these last few years, haven't you? People are starting to ask when they'll see you in the arena, out in Witchwood. But before you go wandering again, I've left a quest card of my own. A favor, if you will. An old friend of mine has gone missing. Calls himself the Archaeologist. He may have stumbled onto something big, perhaps big enough to put his life in danger. There's a rumor that he may be hiding somewhere in Witchwood. That is, if he isn't dead already. You can use a Cullis Gate to get there. I only hope it isn't too late. Okay, so there's a new quest we can go do. You've received a new quest card. Let's go pick that one up real quick. And then we can go out to Witchwood and start working our way towards the arena. That's where I have the most fun. I love the arena. Leave me alone. Fine then. I didn't like you anyway. Let's see. Oh, it's not there. Let's see if it's already in my... Oh, yeah, there it is. Well, let's go do... Yeah, I'll probably go do Traitor Massacre first. Chapel of Scorm is kind of an ongoing one. Now this one's really fun. You just go in here and murder all the guards and uh, traitors you can find. Great when you're an evil character. You're here. About time too. I'm afraid some of the lads couldn't wait and got stuck in early. So let's hurry up and join them while there's still some traders left. Oh, and don't be taking no prisoners, because we've got enough of them already. Alright, let's do this.